Hello friends. How are you all? Welcome to my channel Knowledge Resonance. This is Dr. Kailash Nemade with another useful lecture. Let us start our lecture. In this video, we became familiar with graphene and some amazing facts associated with it. What is graphene? We know that, graphene is a two-dimensional honeycomb arrangement of carbon atoms, which revolutionizing present technology. Its discovery was so significant that it earned Nobel Prize in Physics of 2010. A thin flake of ordinary carbon, just one atom thick, lies behind 2010 Nobel Prize in Physics. Andregman and Konstantin Novoselov have shown that carbon in such a flat form has exceptional properties that originate from the remarkable world of quantum physics. Gman Novoselov extracted the graphene from a piece of graphite such as is found in ordinary pencils. Using regular adhesive tape they managed to obtain a flake of carbon with a thickness of just one atom. This at a time when many believed it was impossible for such thin crystalline materials to be stable. Graphene is technically just a single layer of carbon atoms arranged in a hexagonal pattern. This is so thin that it's roughly a million times, thinner than paper we used at office. Basically, it is considered as two-dimensional thermally stable material at room conditions. The staking of graphene sheets in large number gives graphite. The material was first studied in the 1940s. But it wasn't until 2002 that a University of Manchester research team was able to create it reliably by basically using scotch tape to peel off a layer from graphite. Now we have range of synthesis processes. But mainly we used chemical vapor disposition technique to grow graphene on a copper in a furnace. Practically, graphene can synthesize by many methods. The available methods for synthesis of graphene broadly divided under two main categories. First category is, top-down approach and, second one is bottom-up approach. First, we discuss, top-down approach. In this approach, mainly three processes comes. Namely, mechanical exfoliation, chemical exfoliation and chemical synthesis. Under mechanical exfoliation category, Adhesive tape and AFM tip approach comes. Whereas, chemical synthesis approach depends on probesonication process and reduced graphene oxide approach. Now, the bottom up approach comprises pyrolysis, epitaxial growth, and CVD that is chemical vapor deposition. CVD can be further classified into two class first is thermal and second one is plasma processes. Now we move to simplest route for synthesis of graphene. Graphene can be synthesized from graphite flake using modified electrochemical exfoliation method. In this method, silver electrode was used as a cathodic electrode. It is not necessary to use silver electrode. We can use any metal electrode. For electrochemical exfoliation, graphite flake and silver electrode insert into the ionic solution with separation of approximately 4 cm. The ionic solution can be prepared by diluting 5 ml of sulfuric acid of analytical grade, in 100 ml of deionized water. The electrochemical exfoliation process is carried out by DC bias arrangement using DC voltage 10 volt at room temperature 303 Kelvin. The exfoliated graphene can collect through cellulose nitrate filter paper and washed it with deionized water. In this way, the obtained final suspension of graphene dry at 373 Kelvin for 2 hours. And, graphene is ready for use. Now, we discuss on amazing facts associated with graphene. Graphene, has no band gap, or it is zero band gap material. Graphene, has record breaking strength. Graphene, possesses excellent electrical properties. Graphene, has remarkable transparency of the order 97.7%. On this front, graphene beats syndium tin oxide based transparent conducting oxide in transparency. Graphene, can be stretches up to 20% of its original length. In thermal conductivity, graphene, beats thermal conductivity of diamond. Its thermal properties are better than any other known material. Due to these outstanding properties of graphene, 
A vast variety of practical applications now appear possible including the creation of new materials and the manufacture of innovative electronics. Graphene transistors are predicted to be substantially faster than today's silicon transistors and result in more efficient computers. Now we go through, what is mean by no band gap or zero band gap property of graphene. The electronic band gap is the energy difference between the valence and conduction bands in a semiconductor or metal. And its existence is what allows semiconductor devices to switch electrical currents on and off. Normally, graphene has zero band gap, which is related to its massless electrons. In 2005, when Andre Gm and Philip Kim separately worked on graphene's electrons and showed that the material was showing a zero band gap, this came as a very curious feature that people would probably use. This zero band gap property makes that graphene is not a real semiconductor and could not be used directly by the industry. Many successful attempts were made to create a band gap in graphene by using doped graphene. Another amazing fact of graphene is its strength. Defect free and monolayer graphene is considered to be the strongest material ever tested. Graphene has the intrinsic strength 42 newton per meter, which equates to an intrinsic strength of 130 gigapascal. Graphene is the strongest material in the world, according to new experiments done by researchers at Columbia University. The secret to the material extraordinary strength lies in the strangeness of the covalent between carbon to carbon. Graphene also exhibits the excellent electrical properties. Graphene has remarkable electrical properties thanks to its crystal and band structures. The unique structure of graphene, in which all atoms are surface atoms, makes its electronic band structure and hence electrical properties extremely sensitive to size effects, surface curvatures, as well as environmental interactions. Two-dimensional graphene has unique electrical properties such as, ultra-high electron mobility and ballistic transport at room temperature. These properties make graphene different from any other material. Graphene display remarkable optical properties, including the simple light transparency of visible region. Many researchers demonstrated that monolayer graphene has transparency up to 97.7%. And it reduces to 90.5% for tri-layer graphene. This characteristic of graphene makes it alternative material for transparent conducting oxides, which mainly raises the cost of solar panels. Therefore, graphene is a key solution for photovoltaic technology in many manners. Graphene also contains elastic properties, being able to retain its initial size after strain. Graphene can be stretchable up to 20% of its original length. This property makes graphene enable for flexible applications in various devices. Thermal transport in graphene is a thriving area of research, thanks to graphene's extraordinary heat conductivity properties and its potential for use in thermal management applications. Graphene is considered an excellent heat conductor, and several studies have found it to have unlimited potential for heat conduction. The thermal conductivity increases logarithmically and researchers believe that this might be due to the stable bonding pattern. As graphene is considerably more resistant to tearing than steel and is also lightweight and flexible, its conductivity could have some attractive real-world applications. Thank you. Thanks so much. Please like and subscribe our channel. Click the bell icon to get new and useful video updates.